No, that was one of the craziest plays I've ever done. What the fuck? Oh my god! In general, when you have Blitzcrank, it's really important to pick a strong ADC because Blitzcrank can only hook if his ADC is strong, kind of. And you really want wave control with Blitzcrank. So therefore, I need to pick a strong ADC. Draven is banned, so that means that their only answer to Kalista is banned. And the other two options I have are Kalista, Kai'Sa, Samira, in my opinion. I could also go Varus, but it's a bit weaker, but better later on in a way. But Kalista overall, solid. I mean, Callista is really fun, but she's a big time investment, so definitely one of the hardest ADCs. But she's one of the champs I have the most fun on right now. We're getting so outplayed. Oh no! I didn't think of this guy. Fuck! I felt so safe because I had this ward, I had this, I had this. Who got the shutdown? Oh, Hecarim. If it was Karthus or Renata, that would be fine, but Hecarim is actually going to be scary. What do you Q right after your E? So, if you auto attack a minion, right? I'll just show you. Boom. If I now Q E, you see how the E applies on this, but it doesn't go on cooldown because I reset it off the minion. So, what you can do is essentially get an E Q instead of just a Q. This is really not hitting hooks anymore. He was hitting some hooks at least before. Like what should happen now when I hard push this is that they should have a really hard time last hitting this because Blitzcrank just hooks if they try to last it. So let's see if it happens. So now Blitzcrank should hook. Jesus Christ. The card is flashed too late on a missing hook. Why the fuck is that guy here? I was not expecting that. I think this is a Witsense second game. They have Silas, Hecarim. No, I mean Silas, Karthus. Okay, this is pretty good. This is a good fight now. Karthus can't join. On it somehow. But I misjudged my. Oh, I saw that flash. Oh, I saw that ulti. <laughs> no, I jumped into the true damage. No. Oh, if I jumped back, he was dead. Fuck. <sighs> oh shit, I entered. Why can't I jump? Is this wall too thick? Oh my god, what a fucking int. Either I was at a really shitty angle, or the wall is too thick. And it's thicker than this part. Oh, if I just got the jump off, it was fine. I like it. What the fuck, my Q missed? Guess I'm holding my Herald for now. Ah, I think I put it now. I don't think I'm gonna get a better Herald. Just wanna get the tower. That's about it. I mean, if he does that, then. I 
didn't dodge the... I should have dashed the wall on Silas and then queued up to try to dodge the E. But I don't know why Blitzcrank ran up here. If he just ran down with me, I could have just ulted him, but he ran away from me. Oh, did she spot me? Here TF should go bot if he wants gold. Why we're not just running in at 10 HP? Oh my god, he had Sterex still. I played that so bad. My flesh was like in place. And I didn't calculate the Sterex as my E. But it worked out. I need to think about the Sterex. That was a huge, like it blocked my whole E damage though. I did so little damage to him. I need LDR. It's a bit scary to start Nash. Because they do have really good, uh, like if Seth gets a good ult, I just get one shot without sums. It's a really awkward spot. Yeah, that was a terrible spot to fight in. I mean, maybe I have to go GI. I think we'd commit to the full squishy build though. And I'll have sums for next fight at least. It feels really bad not having Hurricane. They're all melee champs. But this is by far the highest DPS. I think we stick with this. No way. Yeah, I entered it there a bit, but... Nah, that was one of the craziest plays I've ever done. What the fuck? Oh my god! My heart's beating after that one. Can we end the game off it? Hit the Nexus. Holy shit! <laughs> oh my god!